Hey guys, it's Species Sims, and we are back with another installment of A Life is Strange, Episode 4, Dark Room. And I believe this is going to be the last one, so I don't know, this might be kind of short, might be really long, I don't know. Um, where we last left off, Max was at the end of the world party, and she was going in to the Vortex Club VIP area. I'm pretty sure this is kind of at the end. I've been trying not to watch other people's uh, LPs, um, but I have seen like um, parts that I've already like I've already played through. Uh, so I did kind of want to get an idea of like where we were at the end. So I kind of found another uh, LP that they played all the way through. Um, I don't think that they quite go through and do all the little things and look at all the stuff, but. They had like a 20 minute video for the last part and it started right where we ended like when Courtney was bringing Max to the back. So yeah, I kind of have a feeling so this should, this might be the end. Um, but again, don't know, it could be a little bit shorter than most parts, but anyway, so we're going to jump right back in uh, with Max getting into the VIP section and on our hunt for Nathan and holy crap guys, holy crap. Nathan is the Vortex Club. Sorry, I do adjust so my his ass has to be here tonight. Okay. So we already kind of... Okay, so we're still... Let's actually see. We don't have anything... No. Okay, so nothing new. And we only picture that we have... Because uh, we missed those, and I know where they are, is that one. So I don't know if we'll see that. Um, okay, so Damn. look at that. Oh, a bong. Give me a break. Is it me? Oh. Victoria and her mean girls were here. here all fuzzy. I am so She's mean. wasted and nobody is looking out for her. So yeah. Nobody learns at Blackwell. No, they don't. And we can't talk to that dude, but we can talk to What's up, Hayden? Oh hey, Max. I didn't think you'd actually come tonight. This guy sounds like he's always well, freaking high. I didn't think anybody would want a party after Kate Marsh killed herself this week. Have you seen Nathan? I just vaped some dank OG buds, so I can barely see you. Or these hotties next to me. You want a hit? Whoa. No. I want to find Nathan. Me too. He's supposed to be bringing some special party favors. Dude, I this hope. guy. At the party, you actually planned a party at the party. Not this week. So, has anybody here seen Nathan? Bitches, come I on. I guess you have to go ask everybody here. Or, you could sit down <laughs> and take a quick hit. No. Uh, let's ask about Victoria, because we need to find her. Victoria? Because Nathan's yeah, gonna... Go ask her yourself. I would, but like I said, I'm fucking ripped. Dude. Maybe you better take it easy tonight. Whatever. I'm in this world to have fun. Try it sometime, Max. I finally get you and Dana to, to come out to a vortex club party, but that. you just want to lecture me? <laughs> Gee, thanks, Mr. Madsen. How much fun did Kate have at your last party? Listen, Hayden. Just watch out for Nathan tonight. He's I a think dangerous that's fuck. your job, Max. Come back when you're ready to have fun. Douche. Let's talk to Taylor. Max, I love, I love the, all the noise, Taylor, but there's no music. Have you seen Nathan yet? This is awesome. No, that's fine by me. He's been getting like too buggy and kind of scary. Yeah. Victoria might know. Let's see. What does Victoria say about that? She blows it off, but Vic is close with Nathan. They're more like brother sister <laughs> or something. She really cares about him. Is this why you want to be in the Vortex Club? No, Max. I'm like far from home at a great school. I want to learn things, make friends, and party. But when Kate was on the roof, I knew I'd gone too far. Hmm. Kate was dosed at the last Vortex Club party by Nathan. So you should avoid any drink here tonight. Trust me, I won't even drink my own water when Nathan is around now. He's a pharmacy simulator. Mm -hmm. I do have to go now. Look out for yourself, Taylor. And give my best to your mom. Oh, thanks, Max. 
She's doing great after her surgery. Good job, Max. I'm glad to know you're looking out for us, too. Max looks out for everybody. Because she's... My God, this is giving me, like, a... Like, ugh, that oxygen head. kit might come in handy if somebody binges. So, drinks... Food. Pringles? Chips and crackers. Spare no expense, Vortex Club. So the Vortex VIPs get real alcohol at their underage bar. I know Victoria is next on Nathan's Is it just me, or does it seem like really trippy? It could be like all the lights. Uh, did you hear something? Can I talk to you I'm for a second? I'm trying not to. Oh, uh, no. I get it. Have Real you seen Nathan? Nice. What? I can't even get Victoria or Taylor Whoa, to Whoa, that's twerk. weird. And you want to hang with Nathan? Why? I have no idea what the hell just happened there. Business. You should talk to his dad then. Bro has got more money than God, and he spends it on the Vortex Club, not the losers over there in the cheap seats. Logan, this is a swimming pool. In other words, you haven't seen Nathan. Yeah, I don't know As what the Victoria, hell's going on here. She always knows where he is. Why don't you ever want to see me, Max? You're so cute, and we never really talk. Is he high? Maybe a little bit. Whoa. You're a dick! Logan, you're such a dick. You bailed on Dana when she was pregnant. Woo! She needed you most. Now you're trying to mac on me? Are you proud of yourself? Bro, you are giving me the full body tackle. I already feel like an ass for flaking on Dana. Uh, how can I be an undick now? You could start by not trying to sex up every female in front of you. Yeah, the you rest could is probably use a little max, but get it from Warren. Use it well, bro. Oh, and don't ever touch Daniel DaCosta again. You will regret it. Damn! Now, excuse me. Pissed Max Damn. is pissed! That was way more exciting than a dance. Catch what you later, Max. What a freak! He's getting a hard on from this. This is just disturbing as all get out. Uh, oh my god. Oh, this is. Uh, I'm gonna puke. Sorry, Max. <laughs> Vortex Club members only. Sorry. I'm on the guest list. I'm taking you off. Is it just, it's just me or is it like really me, weird? Victoria. I don't have time for this bullshit. Real cute, Max. And after I apologized to you the other day. Do you even have a clue what's going on at Blackwell? You're gonna Kate about to get raped. Herself in front of you and me, everybody here. That's not my this, fault, Max. These lights are trippy. Don't you even try to blame me. No, tell her about Nathan. I blame Nathan for dosing Kate, but nobody at that party even cared she was so wasted. It's a fucking party. Everybody is wasted. What do you want from me? Tell Some her. humanity, Victoria. Well, you got Nathan busted out of Blackwell, so you should be happy. Ye -ye -ye. And I'm the only person here who cares what Nathan is going through. Really? Maybe this you should ask him about his binders. Than a problem, child. I'm not perfect, okay? I'm a teenager at an art school. I'm only here to become a photographer and get famous. <laughs> um. Is that what you were trying to tell Mr. Jefferson last night? Uh, you saw me talking to him? Saw. And heard. Yeah, the lights are tripping me out, man. about how excited he is for the Everyday Heroes contest. That doesn't mean I'm going to win or anything. I hope you win fair. We'll see. And Max, I know you don't like me either, so it's not like we have to be friends or anything. Not enemies. Maybe, but who says we have to be enemies? Whoever makes that decision. That would be us, Victoria. Yeah, duh. Well, Max Caulfield, I could always choose to let you in the Vortex Club. What? Well, I don't care about I the don't Vortex think Club. That's gonna happen. Why don't but we? Not for the reasons. Can we think. tell her that oh, Nathan is so gonna serious. dose her and take pictures? Tell her about the dark room. We're going to tell her about the dark Victoria, room. Victoria, listen to me. Your life is in serious danger. I know Nathan is your friend, but. Tell he her. is truly unstable and dangerous. He did drug Kate at that party so he could take her someplace dark. What? Nice try, Max. But I don't believe you. And why would he do that? That I don't know yet. But it was enough to make Kate want to die. And he killed Rachel. And I think you're next. He has Max, a binder with your that name. That is crazy. 
Nathan is like one of my best friends. Hey, we warned yes, her. Yes, he takes serious meds, but that's not his fault. His family treats him like a total freak just because he has little meltdowns. They're not little anymore. They're deadly. He killed Rachel. I, I don't care if you hate me or not, but you have to believe me. I saw the pictures. Tell her you saw the pictures! You could have been a major bitch to me when I got hit with that paint, and I deserved it. Oh. Max, I don't hate you. I actually think you're one of the coolest people at Blackwell. Weird, but cool. You just don't know it yet. Oh, Maybe no. I'm jealous because you don't give a shit what anybody thinks, and I do. What? To be this honest, weird, but... Nathan has been freaking me out lately. He's not here, oh, and I haven't seen him. So if we just make sure you stay away from him. So if we were mean and to stick her, close to your friends tonight. Uh, okay? Would she be like, I'll screw you, you and go get yourself murdered? One time, and I have other people I can go to for protection. Thanks for telling me this, Max. If what you said is true, then you be careful too. Oh, I have to find Chloe. Protection. Yeah, she's um, got a gun. Text me if you need anything. So, so if we spilled paint on her and were a bitch Thanks to her, to she would have been like, "Screw you," and had gotten murdered, and then when she, her blood would be on her hands. Is that what we're saying? Well, shit. Oh, oh, oh no! Shit's gonna go down. Shit's gonna go down. Shit's gonna go down. Chloe's got a gun. Do 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 do. Maybe there's hope yet for Victoria and me. Let's see what else is over I'm here. I'm glad I warned her. I hope she's okay. We can go talk to other people. You dance worse than my dad. This is tripping yes. me out, though, what like with the lights and like the walking. Level. That son of a bitch is not here. <sighs> Where are you? Hey, Max! I can't believe you showed up. Why didn't you tell me? We could have dressed up together. Nobody else is wearing costumes. I my outfit. I, I was in a hurry. You're wearing the same outfit you always wear, Dana. Dana. Have you seen Nathan around? Hell no. I've been dancing with Trevor. Come on and dance with us. <laughs> Look at Trevor trying to bust a move. <sighs> end of the world. How's the end of the world going? Great. This has been the worst fucking week of my life, so I needed to act like a carefree student tonight. Yep. For Kate. Yep. I hear you, Dana. But I want you to avoid Nathan if you see him. Tell okay? everyone. I will if I want to have fun. I still feel sorry for him. He shouldn't. He needs help, but not from his family. He does need help. Mm -mm. What do you know about his dad, Sean Prescott? Raging douche! Uh, rich. And rich. And a dickhead, according to Nathan. And the he's trying to get a buy a happy son. family or a happy club. Sounds like you're ready for a change. I don't need any club to be cool or have friends. Look at you. <laughs> Plus, I like hanging with Trevor <laughs> and his theater such friends. such a douche no drama. statement! It sounds like a plan, Dana. I don't need to have I'm cool friends. Sure like, look at you. You're fine. Thanks. Thanks. The boy cannot dance, though. Look at that. Yeah, yep. Electric Boogaloo. Look at his terrible dance I moves. I love that Trevor doesn't care how goofy he dances in the VIP section. Look at the DJ. I know we the have Vortex like... Club actually hired DJ Doom for the party. That's funny. We can't talk to these douche. The VIP section is so lame. We can I look at... So Juliet like... hooked up with Zachary again? Well, uh, she's probably drunk. Zachary, if you mess with Juliet... I will kick your balls on a loop. Some douche dancing. Chair. Let's sit down for a second. What are we going to ponder? It feels all jerky and weird to me. Maybe it's just Kate my game. Dead. Rachel dead. Oh. Enter the Vortex Club. Look at these entitled assholes. They don't give a shit about anybody. I like her inner monologues. If that tornado came right now. I would just sit here and watch for a while. But I have to make sure Chloe doesn't go on her own rampage. <sighs> I hate feeling this way. It's dark and angry. Well. Nathan kind of makes you that way. They're not all entitled assholes. Some of them are your friends. They're decent people. So we're just panning around now to everything that we've already looked at. Yeah, I think we are. Can we go look over at the bartender again? Yeah, okay. So we looked at everything. So there's nothing over <laughs> this way. <laughs> tickle, stop it. The tickle, okay. stop it. Hey, hey. Okay. She's like. 
Can you? I'm gonna like interrupt them. Just relax. Someone's gonna see us. That's kind of funny that you can sneak back there while like kids are getting it on. Oh, that makes me want to pull a carry on the Vortex Club. Okay, so that's it. Let's go to Chloe. We've already gone through these guys. Get my way, Trevor. Trevor! There you are. Uh, what? Well, Chloe, Nathan isn't here. Nobody has seen him tonight. He's definitely not upstairs or in the lockers. Damn. Maybe he's hiding Mr. in the Mr. Jefferson is here. Bail. Why? Nathan oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, uh... Oh hey, God, Mr. Jefferson? Mr. Jefferson's in on it, isn't he? Are you both okay? You look like you're on a, a mission. Oh, uh, I was just looking for Nathan. Uh huh. I didn't know you were pals with him. I haven't seen him since. I'm this wondering afternoon. if he's. He, I really wonder he if he's the one taking the pictures. I think he's still quite upset over the, uh, the whole Kate situation. I think. Yeah. Oh. That makes sense. Um. Let's talk later, Max. I have to announce the winner of the contest. I do wish you would have entered. You have to build up that resume and portfolio, but I just I know you will. I wonder Thanks. now. Oh I God. So. Okay, excuse me. I'm almost on. Let's get the hell out of here, Max. I wonder if it's him. I wonder if he's the one because somebody was taking pictures of Nathan with those girls, and somebody pointed out in like. Okay, okay. everybody, calm down. Thank you. Thank you. Somebody pointed I, I out in it. their like I don't want to get in the way of the party, but it's time you know, to an analysis that he always takes weird pictures of like women and stuff, so I would oh, Before oh I god. Do, I want to thank everybody who oh, no. their photograph and everybody who thought about it. It's gonna be this Victoria. We're gonna take her to the dark room. Of being an artist. Sharing your work with the world. All of you represent Blackwell Academy and everything our school stands for. As far as I'm concerned, you're all everyday heroes. Something's going you down. Know, please. Something's going down. And the winner is... It's gonna be Victoria. Oh my, what a shocker. I knew it. Victoria Chase. And he's gonna take her to the dark room. Oh god, he's in on it, isn't he? If he's not, I'd be surprised. I just feel like that's where this is going. You know, because they've Thank got the binder so for Victoria. Much, it was your incredible photography that brought me to Blackwell, and I hope Kate I can was his, live up to uh, your like, name. Teacher's and assistant. Thanks. I also want to thank all the students for being so dedicated in their pursuit. And I'd like to dedicate this prize to what an ass the memory bitch. of Kate Marsh. She was the real everyday hero what? of Blackwell. Mm, this girl, thank such you. a douche. She's such a douche. You suck, Victoria! Victoria won. Big surprise. I can't believe she blackmailed Jefferson. No. Yes, I can. Who fucking cares? Rachel is still dead, and I want Nathan's punk ass. Now! Me too. Let's go check out the dormitories. Oh god. Okay. This might be longer than I thought. Oh Christ. Nathan just texted me. He says there won't be any evidence left after he's done. Glad you got one Shit. last look at Rachel. <gasps> we have to go to the junkyard right now. How does he know? How does he know that they were there? Oh my god. Oh my god, the double moon is flickering and just disappeared. What the fuck? What the fuck? Why was it there? Stop stomping around, Chloe. Right. Just get ready to use your rewind fast if Nathan tries to jump us. Oh god, what are we gonna do? Oh shit. Do I have to do anything? Oh god. We're gonna die. We are so gonna die. Someone is gonna die. Oh, am I supposed to be, like, walking with her? Okay, no, I'm not. Oh, okay. It wasn't letting me, uh... Where did she go? Oh shit, Chloe, where the fuck are you? It wasn't letting me walk at first when I tried. Rachel. If it's over here, yeah, no. This is where we kind of saw the deer. God, I want to fucking kill that little psycho. Hey, I can't focus if you're yelling. Please. 
Yeah. This is where we first saw the deer around the side of the um Where we saw the deer over here is where Rachel is buried. Come on. Come on. Nathan needs to die now. Yes, <sighs> please God hurry. Sake. Oh my god, this is where we saw the deer. The deer ran from there. Oh god, that's <gasps> She's still there. Don't look, Chloe. Oh god, Nathan's behind you! <gasps> no. Oh god! Oh my god! Oh my god! Chloe! Look out! What the fuck? <gasps> Actually cry. You shot her right in between the eyes. Oh my god. I knew it. I knew it. Oh my god. <gasps> oh my god. Fucking God Um Oh my god, that is like the best fucking ending ever because holy shit my mind is blown. Oh my god. No, no, everyone talked about Mr. Jefferson being shady and you were like, I don't know, and then it was just when he got up there to announce that Victoria won, you were like, oh god, it's gonna be Victoria because he has something to do with it. He has something to do with it, and oh god, Holy shit! He just shot Chloe right between the eyes. She's fucking dead. There is no fucking way she's coming back from that. Oh my god. I am so devastated right now. I don't even know what to think. I think my heart is like racing in my chest right now. Like I... Holy shit. Oh my god, this game is so fucking good! Oh my god, I don't think I can breathe right now. I'm not even kidding. I am not even kidding. I can feel my heart racing in my chest right now. I can't believe that this just fucking happened. Holy shit. Oh my god, guys. I... Uh, okay. All right, all right, all right. We need to just... I need to... Oh, I need to process this, but okay. Um, so 56% of people accepted Chloe's request to kill her. We refused it. Wow, I can't believe that many people were willing to kill her. I guess whether you did it or not, you still rewound, because I was kind of curious how that would play out. Um, we let Warren beat up Nathan, and <laughs> more people stopped it. Hell no. No one got hurt. Okay, so that's really cool. We did pretty good on that one. It took a long time to get to that point. Victoria believed your warning. Victoria didn't believe... Her. Okay, so I'm going to bet if we had been a bitch to Victoria, she wouldn't believe our warning. So, but see, the thing is, she believed our warning about Nathan, but Mr. Jefferson is... The oh, God! Oh, my God! Mr. Jefferson is a psycho! I knew somebody had to be taking pictures! Is Mr. Jefferson... Nathan's father? <gasps> I was kind of wondering if that would be like a real crazy twist because like he's like, oh, my son, blah, blah, blah. Or like maybe when they keep thinking it's notes from his quote unquote father, it's like some kind of weird cult thing and his quote unquote father isn't his actual father. It's Mr. Jefferson. I don't know. Hey guys, I am just popping in while I'm editing this uh, just to kind of go off that last point. I was kind of watching somebody else's playthrough after I recorded this um, and I noticed when Max checked the note on Nathan's desk like then and she was like oh it's from his father and it said something about like oh I'm trying to teach you my ways blah 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 it was never signed by anybody 
So Max kept thinking that a lot of these things were Nathan's father, but I don't think a lot of them had any kind of signatures, like all the text messages and everything, like you're calling out my name, you're saying this on the phone, blah, blah, blah. I think they were all from Jefferson and they weren't Nathan's father. Max just assumed they were. And, you know, we were just kind of going with her assumptions. So just wanted to kind of pop that in there. So woo that was just a sign all along that it wasn't really his father doing a lot of these messages. It was Mr. Jefferson. <sighs> Okay, and I'm going to cut back into finishing the rest of uh, our stats. So I just wanted to pop in and say that because I figured it out after. And I just wanted to share it with you guys. Okay, so we saved the Blue Jay. Of course, Why would more people let the Blue Jay die? What about a bag of dicks you guys are? Jesus. Okay, we didn't disturb the bird's nest um, because we put the plank back. So I guess if you left the plank away, that would, you know... Um, you got in David's files another way. Although I do know the code now after I did that. So, Kate helped you find Nathan's room. Kate didn't help you. Kate couldn't help us. She was dead. Um, uh, that's actually a scene I did see because I saw somebody who did an LP. And I was like, whoa, wait a minute. Why do they have a scene with Kate? If, if Kate hadn't died, there would have been a scene where we went and talked to her in the hospital right before we went to Nathan's room. So she probably would have told us as opposed to we have to wander around and find it. Um, you motivated Daniel to have the Vortex party, uh, so the other ones you didn't, so more people didn't. Wow, we are, like, a majority of the time going against what everybody else did. Wow. You left a, you didn't leave a message on Warren's slate. Oh! Oh, you know what, because we didn't go to that side of the, the dorms, because I went to the left, and I normally walk around and poke everything, and this time I didn't, so I missed, I missed two photos, because I don't know where that other photo was. Um, I don't. I didn't see a place where we could actually get that photo. So, uh, you didn't figure out Nathan's pin code, right? Okay. Um, which was actually his birthday, I think. Um, so when they kept saying it's on his file, it was his, like, whatever his actual like month and day was. And then we helped Alyssa. Oh my God, though. Okay, I'm gonna. Okay, we're gonna exit this now and we're going to see the teaser for episode five guys so holy crap i'm still having heart palpitations i think i'm having a heart attack uh so whoo i don't know if i can handle this but here we go oh dear god oh my god I already killed Chloe. <sighs> oh my fucking god! <laughs> oh my god! Okay. Well, guys. Um. Okay, so... That was episode four, Dark Room, and holy shit, um, oh my god, I still, I have feels, I'm, I'm gonna go cry now, and I'm probably going to cry for the next six to eight weeks before episode five comes out, because I don't think I can handle this, I can't believe he shot Chloe, holy shit, guys, um, alright, so I leave you here, I will see you guys in six to eight weeks when episode five comes out, I... Hope you enjoyed this crazy fucked up ride and had just as much of a heart attack at the end of this one as I did. Uh, so I will see you guys when we come back for episode 5. Remember, give the video a big thumbs up and subscribe to see more.